Okay. I'm gonna, this is, uh, get ready. <laughs> okay, uh, this is MakerBot. We just launched a new extruder today that um, it's actually half as small as our old extruder, so you can put two of them in a MakerBot thingamatic, which is kind of exciting. <laughs> I feel like kind of a badass because we uh, launched, the, because we, we announced that in the New York Times this morning. <laughs> Um, so what are you sharing? This is, this is really sort of preaching to the choir, saying like, share or die, but um, <laughs> share or die. <laughs> so you can make a lot of things with a MakerBot. Um, you can do really cool things. Uh, and then you can do mashups. So you can take like a bunny and a rabbit and make a drabbit. <laughs> is Tony in the room? Where's Tony? Tony Buser, calling Tony Buser. Is he feeling shy? Okay, maybe he's downstairs. Uh, he's, uh, so you just put things two together. This is a story about a gangsta made by Wiseorg. Is Wiseorg here by any chance? Dang. <laughs> he's a badass. He made this gangsta that is a, a, has kind of got a hoodie and, and really bad posture. <laughs> and um, licensed it under a nice license, and then it turns out, so I think we made this thing called Thingiverse because we, we kept losing our files for digital things, and it turned out to be easier to make a website than to get a hard drive. And so, <laughs> um, we made it so everybody can use it, and we really, if you make things and have designs for physical objects, share it on Thingiverse, because that'll make you a badass. Um, so here's the gangsta, print it out, yeah. But then, uh, the, here's a snake, like a skeletal snake. Put those two together, you have the snakesta. <laughs> the resta, devilsta, stylista, buddhsta, buddhsta, the legend continues, which is the talisman, and the Buddha, and the, yeah. Uh, rabbitsta, rapus gangstas, bunnysta. Um, so this is two ways, bunny head on the gangsta, gangsta body on the bunny. <laughs> Tron bunny, optimus bunnyus, primesta. <laughs> But uh, yeah, uh, this is um, well, this is cool. Multiple parts. You press it, it falls over. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hand set on carbonate. <laughs> <laughs> Gangster in carbonate. Carbonite stuff. This is a pretty meta. It's a sta sta. It's what happens when you take half a gangsta with half a gangsta. <laughs> Walt Disney's head, a brain. Uh, Jordan's actually here. Where's Jordan? Yeah. Um, put them together, you get brainy Walt Disney stuff. <laughs> Make it go pee. What could, and then eventually, you eventually. <laughs> <it's just dumb. laughs> These. <laughs> It goes on and on and on and on. Um, sign of the gangsta. And it all swings back around. Lazor well, just did this one. This one just came up. Yodsta or gangda. <laughs> so this is all pretty easy to do. Mesh mixer, open scat. Ooh, any open scatters in the room? Yeah. Uh, the way this works is because we have a culture of sharing. We want people to share things. We share things and we think it's cool. Um, yeah. This is, I'm, I cut this part out of my talk because it was too long, but a bunch of folks got together and said, wouldn't it be cool if we just print out a, a clock, you know, know what time it is? <laughs> yes. And so they did. Um, so collaborations, one of the things about collaboration, if you want it to happen, it helps to get people together and to eat. Good job, co co coordinators of this project, this space, because we all ate together, and that does things. Um, big ideas, there's a bunch of big ideas, you already know this. So, big question, I knew I was gonna get this. Uh, make about we just raised 10 million bucks. Uh, <laughs> and everybody keeps asking me, is MakerBot gonna stay open source? Yes. <laughs> um, 
So we're not going to, I mean, is MakerBot going to stop being open source? No. <laughs> that, that's what I meant to say. But so yes, we are going to stay open source. Uh, it's interesting because people, we, we, we're in, we are, in, the people in this room are in a time capsule a little bit ahead of many, many, uh, the rest of the world. And <laughs> so we have to, we're living in the future. We've created this way where community rules. Community kicks ass. Community acts as the police person. <laughs> community is, you know, if you do, it's a duocracy. If you do something awesome, you get to be awesome. So, um, <laughs> but we also live in a time where patents exist, where uh, where where competition is is rooted in is deep rooted in kind of like brutalist version of capitalism, and we have to survive. So. Uh, one of my challenges that is kind of interesting is as we grow as a company, we started getting the letters that say, and we've been really careful with IP with MakerBot, making sure we, we only build on patents that are expired, and whenever we come up, we've come up with some freaking awesome things, and we go to clear them through the patent office, and we can't. So there's awesome things coming into seven and 15 years. <laughs> so, we have to work around them and find other ways of doing them and that kind of thing. And we, we get the letters that say, yeah, we saw you got $10 million. Here's a list of all the numbers of our patents, just in case you didn't know. And we're watching you. <laughs> Which to me is a great letter, because that from an IP lawyer means they don't have anything on us yet. <laughs> or you know, they, they could always sue us into oblivion if they wanted to, but um, I have you all on my team. And I don't think they want to mess with us. <laughs> so how can we make the future more open? Publishing your ideas is the best freaking thing to do. How many of you have a project that's trapped in your hard drive? Just admit it. It's fine. OK. Your job is to get that stuff out there. Even the ideas that you think are foolish, absurd, and will probably not work. Publish that crap, because that kind of stuff is really important, because it may not work now, but in a few years, somebody may have already patented that, in, and it might be possible then, but you didn't publish it, and now you can't do it, because well, you can't do it as a business, because somebody else did it. So my call to you all is public, like, publish that crap. I get, that's what a horrible rallying call. But <laughs> please, please take your ideas and let them, set them free in a place like a blog that has a date and timestamp. Okay. Thank you.